Hi guys, it's the Peculiar Planner and I'm back. Thanks for stopping back by my channel and for those that are new to my channel, welcome. Well guys, guess what? I'm here with a DIY. Now, I knew this one loop needed a dashboard because the Happy Planner doesn't have yet dashboards for the twin loop planner so i wanted to make me one because i'm like man i need to you know try to diy me some accessories for this twin loop planner because i'm so in love with it but i can't add nothing to it but stickers so what i did you guys i made let me see if i can get you a close-up a dashboard to go into the twin loop planner now it was hard you know i broke a couple dashboards because it actually got stuck now i tried it real quick just with this um the blue classic punch i'm going to come back and do another video and see what the pink big punch does because i think that might be better because like when i punch this dashboard and bear with me guys because I'm actually at work and I decided to do this so I don't have all my equipment with me so I'm like actually holding my phone and doing this video showing you guys this um, but what I actually did was line that up in there and did the punches now guys it got stuck so this is kind of like a don't do this at home unless you know what you're doing. So it kind of got stuck. So what I did, there's screws. There's screws in the back of the punch. And then here's the rest of all these goodies. I unscrewed them so that I can get this dashboard out. Unscrewed it. Um, yeah, so I gotta put all of that back together. All of this back in there and that's my little you know, girly tool kit. I had to pull that out real quick so that I could take this apart. Excuse me, take this apart. See that? Guys, um, it comes apart and it does go back together. Not really hard, but it is a little tedious. So I advise, you know, maybe not taking it apart. Unless you have the time like me, because I do the graveyard shift. So I'm here all night. So I have time. To screw all this back in but okay guys so the purpose of this video so the dashboard look at it now here's a couple of them that got stuck but I'm going to refix that no problem because look and again guys this is just my first trial run but I kept thinking about it and thinking about it and I'm like listen see now here right here right here I'm gonna have to punch it again the punch didn't go all the way through because of course you know the blue classic is for one sheet of paper I believe um so it's not really for this dashboard but once you know I really pushed like majority of them went and he kind of didn't punch and I think there was another maybe that's the only one okay so just to see, look at that. I'm like halfway there, guys. Because all you had to do, let me show you with this divider. So you know how there's nine holes right here. There's nine holes already on the dividers here. So what I did, and excuse me again, guys, because I'm holding this with one hand. So I made my punch holes in between here. So now we're actually going to have 18 holes, you know, so I punched the holes in there because that's how the twin loop is. It's not perpendicular to the happy planner divider punches, like the holes that's already, sorry guys, the holes that's already on the happy planner. So you have this here in the middle. So that's where I punched my holes. So that's how we got this to be on here. So your girl's at it again, you know, making dashboards because we can do a lot with these dashboards and making our own. And I just want this to get out to Happy Planner that we need dashboards for 
or twin loop planners like for all of our planners because we just love all the happy planner accessories and we love snapping things in like that's what intrigues us and keep in mind that it was made here first from the peculiar planner so i just enhanced um happy planners products but you know i'm gonna need a little bit of that shout out because i actually was brainstorming this like i needed the batter but anyway because happy planner knows that i love them Okay, so let me find, oh, I'm not good with this one hand or with this phone. So let me find this hole that I need to punch. And I'll make sure I get that in the middle here. So just kind of kind of slide that back in. And then we'll punch it. Oh, sorry guys. I thought I'm not good with this one hand in the phone. Let's see. There we go. Hold on. I'll be right back on camera. I gotta use two hands to push this punch down. Okay, uh, so I'm back. Now you see I have it, it's in. So I'm gonna punch it. You hear that? Punch. Now hopefully it didn't get stuck again. And I can pull it out. It didn't. There you have it, guys. The first twin loop dashboard. Here, let's see if I can get a better review here. Look at that. Look at it, guys. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so now look. And again, I'm doing this with one hand. I want you to see that. It really works. Here, let me go and try this hand. And yes, I broke some nails on this. I mean, they were already busted, but I kind of busted them up some more. But it's well worth it. <laughs> Look at that. Guys, I have a dashboard inside my twin look. Uh, let me fix it. Sorry. <laughs> Push it all the way down, 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 down. Um, I have the twin loop dashboard. Super pumped, super pumped. So guys, let Stephanie Fleming know at the Happy Planner that it's possible that this twin loop planner can get a dashboard. Look at that. Guys, you see that? See, Stephanie? Look, and then we even got an extra one over, but we can easily cut that off. And extra here, see, is how we cut on it, but boom, it works. It works, it works, it works. Look at that. Huh. So I'm back with a dashboard plan, you know. <laughs> I did it for wrong, wrong, so if you are new to my video, then please go back, watch a couple of them, see how I made a dashboard for a mini micro planner. And then now, I did a dashboard for the twin loop planner. And it's really simple, it's really easy. The hardest part is sitting and thinking about it and seeing how it can really go. And then doing stuff like this, that you gotta put it back together. Which it ain't that hard, but I gotta push like these springs back down, put it back in, screw the screws in. That's why I was like busting up my nails but it's well worth it. So, if you're new to my channel and you like this video, please do hit the like button. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think about my DIY for my twin loop planner. Also, if you need to subscribe, I encourage you to subscribe and to hit the bell so that you can keep up with me and to see the plans that I have going on. That's all I got for now, you guys. Stay tuned for part two because I might try it again with the pink big 
punch. I think that might be a little better. We'll see what we do, but your girl will be back making more dashboards for whatever planner she's going to use. So thank you guys for watching. And as always, happy planning. Bye guys.